Welcome to Be Young RV today in Milwaukee, Oregon, the greater Portland metro area here in the Willamette Valley along the Willamette River. And today I'm going to introduce you to the 365 RL from Bay Hill, which is part of the Evergreen RV. This is a beautiful coach. As we start with this front piece, one piece cap up here, which is painted. You'll notice we have LED docking lights up here, adds to a real nice attraction to it. You'll see the big cargo hold inside here. And uh, there's two five gallon bottles here with a slide out tray. Then there's another five gallon bottle on the other side. And you can see how big the door is and how thick they are. Look at this, lamb lock style, you lift up the bottom. The other thing is the spare tires in here. Instead of sticking in the back, so if you did have an emergency, I can sure get that spare tire out a lot easier at my age anyway. All right, as I said, we had another five gallon bottle. That's 15 gallons of propane. And if you ever had a bad bottle, these are a lot cheaper to exchange out. So quite a few manufacturers are going that away. LED lights out here. You notice the speakers are here instead of clear up there, which I couldn't hear them, but at least here I can hear if I put a TV out here. And this is a vacuum bonded wall with double uh, gel coat siding on here. You can see how smooth, no ripples. We got frameless windows. Of course, we've got an electric awning also that covers the door and this huge side here. We get to these doors here. This is a massive storage area. Look at this inside of there. It was carpeted, laid out. It's wrapped up underneath the aluminum uh, framing up underneath here. You got central vac, you got shelves in here, 50 amp, a marine style cord, good strong doors too. I'm gonna be lazy and just snap it locked like that. Of course, outside plugs. Now you'll notice the front levelers are down up here. This does have six point automatic hydraulic leveling system on it. There's one up there, one in front of the front wheels by the door here, and behind the rear wheels is another uh, uh, jack. Again, these walls are vacuum bonded. That includes the side walls here at the window. That's a real positive thing. LED lights, LED lights, ladder, bonded again, not a hollow wall back there, expecting the rear window to hold it together. Now we have three slides on this side. They all use the Swintech system by Lipiter, which allows taller slides, lighter weight in here. We will have a rack and pinion on the other slide. Again, bonded walls. Tankless hot water heater. Uh, we do have them in motor homes, like, you know, half a million dollar motor homes use tankless hot water heater. Here you have it in the Bay Hill. The only brand line that we have has that. Your service panels here is all in one. So you got your black flush, your cable, satellite hookup, sewer and wastewater, of course they're enclosed underbelly, your shower system. Look at the length of that hose. I mean I can reach and wash the tires here. Oh don't get caught in the state state, state park doing that though. Alright, and then uh, and up underneath here, so nobody can tamper with it, it'll be your automatic leveling system. So uh, once you get it off the truck. Just push auto leveler and it automatically levels. Like I said, you got a slide tray here. Pull propane tanks out and make it easier to get them in and out. Your hydraulic systems here. All right, well I think it's time to go inside and look at the interior of the Bay Hill. You're gonna love it. Well, welcome to the interior of the Bay Hill, the 365 RL, which means rear living. I want you to look at this kitchen in here. Look at it. This is uh, Corian. It's just not any Corian. This is Martha Stewart Corian design. Look at this. Bullet edges here. Stainless steel sink with a Corian going over the top. Mowing faucet with a pull out for washing vegetables. And the sprayer system. 22 inch oven big microwave. The drawers, you'll love the drawers. Look at that. Let's do it again. Cub it. Sucks back in. Look at the cabinets up here. Four door Norco refrigerator. Lots of room for ice. Look at that. 12 cubic foot. Got a place over here for the toaster, coffee pot, of course. Moving along here. 
Look at that drawer. Nice. So you go back in. And this uh, interior color here is going to be the uh, Madison Brown. We even got a dishwasher. Now some people go a dishwasher. Well, some people still use uh, uh, glass plates, you know, maybe Malmac. They could even use it for storage if they wanted to, the dishes. But anyway, this comes with it. Of course, over here we get uh, two fixed chairs and two folding chairs. They got them all out here and must have had somebody visiting. And you got some extra leaves on the table to expand it out. Otherwise, put it back in. I'm going to have nightshades. Basically, because the glass is 90% dark tinted, so it's hard to see in here. Unless you got all the lights on at night, so you got a nightshade. The other thing you're going to like, we have light switches for almost every light except for the little tiny ones over here on the wall. Of course, you got residential furniture in here with the uh, Lauren Ashley furniture. These are uh, recliners. Moving on, like I say, light switches. What do you think of this cabinet here? I mean, that's real wood. Bay Hill gla etched glass. Again, LED lights here. These are about the only ones I got to push on, the little tiny ones. And this is uh, like stadium seating. Again, we have uh, recliners here. We got one on, we got three of them here. Nice big window back here. You can see from the kitchen. Cabinets up above. You notice the crown of the roof here is a crowned roof with crown molding. The intake for the air conditioners up here. We got ducted AC, but this also comes with another 13,005 BTU uh, ducted AC in the bedroom. So we can use this down in uh, Arizona or Northern California when it gets really hot. Of course, it's got a nice uh, Sansui TV here, real thin one, lightweight. And a bracket to be able to turn it around to the chairs or to the kitchen. They put a really good TV in here. Of course, you got the 5,000 BTU capable uh, fireplace, electric, you're in a park instead of using your propane, or you can have it for aesthetics like we have right now. You can work your uh, iPhones with this particular uh, Jensen radio up here, Bluetooth, speakers up here. That's your DVD for your television also up here. Keep it simple. Let's head up to the uh, bedroom and the bathroom. Got nice steps going up in here. Master control panel here for outside lights and the slide outs. You'll notice we have a, we got four slides in here. We got a switch for each one. And of course the awnings here. We do have a door that separates the bedroom. And uh, this happens to be a wide body unit. You can see how wide the door is in here. Wide body means that our wheels are out at 102 inches out there and there aren't too many manufacturers that make wide body. That's why the bathroom's big in here. We'll have a toilet off to the right, porcelain toilet. We've got a 50 inch molded fiberglass shower in here. We've got the Martha Stewart Corian countertop in the bathroom, a big oval. Now think about coming into this bedroom. This is a wide body. I have to emphasize there aren't many uh, fifth wheels made as a wide body so a human can get up through the steps there. Uh, first off I want to talk about this closet here. Now you can use this for a hanging closet but if you do want to put washer dryer in here you have room to put side by sides in here and then you have room above to be able to operate it you know if you got a top loader. Isn't that something? Look at the finish work on this. Now you have a nice stand on this side here. It is a king size bed. And this is a whole slide that slides out. Again, I talked about light switches. You have switches on these LED lights in here. And again, this is a, a very good mattress they put in here. King size. Here's the control for um, your extra air conditioner up here. Your main uh, cooling and heat is in the other switch in the, coming up the stairs does have a TV in here, another Sansui, think about it, they have matching TVs in this uh, uh, fifth wheel. So many products come with different product, you know, like two or three different TVs. Man, it's got a bracket to swing out, nice uh, uh, desk here. Place for a garbage can up here, work spot if you wanted to. I do like the Bay Hill. Now, if I was selling this to my friend Brian Henniger, the PGA player, he'd have it already autogrammed, right? Anyway, 
Look at that closet. I can get in here, I can sit in here and do my shoes in here. Right, and you can lock those in place. All right, so that's your closet. So I'm welcoming you all to come to Be Young RV and look at our vast assortment of Bay Hill fifth wheels. If you don't like this floor plan, we got many more. And besides the Bay Hills, we do carry the Solitudes by uh, Grand Designs. We got the Redwood by Thor. Uh, we have the Crusader by uh, Primetime, the Sanibel by Primetime. Uh, we got so many, it's hard to believe. Uh, you know, Be Young RV, uh, they want to take care of the recreational people, the full timers. And uh, this is a great place to uh, come and shop and find the right coach for you. Again, this is Frank with B Young RV. Feel free to come by anytime here in uh, Milwaukee, Oregon on McLaughlin Boulevard along the Willamette River. Thank you.